Hi and thank you for purchasing the Virtual Studio 6 template pack. This project is compatible with Adobe After Effects CS6 and above, as well as Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's take a look at how to customize it. First download the delivery zip file and make sure you unpack all the files before opening up any project. Inside the project folder you will find an After Effects version and a Premiere Pro version of the template. So let's open up the AE version first. Inside the project you will find the 00uChange folder, which contains all the editable elements. The intro section contains 9 media placeholders, a logo holder and 4 background text holders. The 00 intro composition has markers so you can easily locate the images on the timeline. Now let's import some images and a logo file. Select File, Import File, and choose your files. Make sure your logo file is in PNG, PSD, or any other format with transparency. Next, double click on any image holder and drag your image into the timeline. Delete or turn off the sample layers and you can press S to bring down the scale property and adjust the size if needed. The same for the logo composition, double click to open it and drag your logo file. To change the background texts, open up any text composition and double click on the text layer to edit it. Now let's move on to the lower thirds section. We have included two lower thirds. Let's choose the first one. Open up the second layer and double click on the text layers to edit the text. Also, in the main lower third composition, we have built a control system for the position, size and color. Select the control layer and click on the effect controls panel. If you can't see this panel, press F3 to bring it up. You can also change the duration of the lower third animation by moving this second marker. Now let's move on to the scenes section. Open up any angle. There are elements that you can turn on or off in the scene. In this case, you can choose between a desk or a table. Let's open up the talent comp and import the presenter footage. Press the transparency toggle if needed to see the sample guide body shot and adjust the position of your actor accordingly.
All the other angle compositions are editable in a similar way and we've added all the scenes inside the 00, zero main composition. You can choose to work with all of them or create your own variation. From the Transitions section, you can choose a transition and drop it into the timeline. And finally, let's take a look at rendering this project. Select the main composition and choose Composition, Add to Render Queue. Under Output Module, choose Format, QuickTime, Format Options, Photo JPEG, Quality 95, check the Audio Output box. Hit OK and click next to Output tool to set the destination path of your file. Then just click Render. Thank you for watching and in the next tutorial we'll take a look at how to edit the Premiere Pro version of this template.